You will love to use your hand to paddle in the water when you want to take a breath outside the water. Paddling will help your head to go out to breathe in before blowing again bubbles. Now for example, paddle, paddle, breathe, and again. Paddle, paddle, breathe, and again. You need to paddle with your hand. One, two, three, four, paddle. One, two, three, four, paddle. One, two, three, four, paddle. You need to paddle when you go up, not before. One, two, three, four, paddle. One, two, three, four, paddle. Okay, listen. You are paddling too early. You need to paddle at the time you want to go up. You don't paddle before. It's when you want to go up, then you pull, okay? Because you pull, your head will go up. If you go, if you pull before, at the time you go up, you have nothing to push the water and to stabilize up. That's a bad mistake. So when you want to go up, when you want to breathe, you paddle in the same time. One, two, three, four, five. You want to go up now and breathe? Pull at the same time. Don't pull and then go up, okay? Pull and go up together. Your heads go up, your hands start to pull. So you need to move your hand when you want to go up. Look, you blow your bubbles. One, two, three, four, five. Drink the bubbles, you fly. And then after fly, you want to breathe, right? So you can move your hand in the water. Take a breath and go down. Look, one, two, three, four, five. I want to breathe, I move my hand. And I fly again. Let's go together. One, two, three, four, five. Move your hand and bubbles. When you want to go ahead, paddle with your hands. Paddle with your hand, bubbles. See, paddling with your hands after the flying. So, you do. One, two, three, four, five. Paddle with your hand to go, to go up and blow bubbles again, okay?